her in her crib to die. Justice tonight for a Valley grandfather killed at a family wedding. The murder happened in Lynchburg, Virginia, and seven months later, one of the three teenage suspects has been sentenced. All new at 10, Rudabay Shabazi shares the 911 tapes and whether the people who love that grandfather think this is enough. I miss George. I miss George picking up the paper every morning. We just think about him, we remember him, and, and now we talk about him. Some people even talk to him, I'm sure. Nothing can bring back George Baker, but there is some closure tonight for those who loved him. That elder lady was just shot. She was beaten, kicked in the head, and they, uh, they left him on the ground here. We just found him. The 81-year-old was randomly beaten to death by three teenagers while in Virginia to attend his granddaughter's wedding. And a man wouldn't hurt a fly. He would just happen to be in the wrong place at the wrong time. And tonight, a 14-year-old has been sentenced to juvenile detention until he's 21. He was 13 at the time of the beating. I, I think he probably knew what he was doing. Kids buy double digits with what's on television and video games. They know what life and death is. And they know what causes life and death. Police say a 16 and 17 year old were also involved in punching and kicking Baker as he walked down the street. The friend who lived next door for three decades tells me there's a hole in his heart, but also forgiveness. I don't want any physical harm to come to those uh, to those boys, but I, I do hope that they know what they've done and feel regret themselves. The 17-year-old was tried as an adult and convicted of first-degree murder. The case against the 16-year-old is still pending. Reporting live in the newsroom, Rudabay Shabazi, ABC 15 News.